morning everyone it's Melody I am at downtown Disney walking into Disneyland I am with Rodney we're actually here with one of the choirs that he performs with it's a school choir Valhalla which was actually his alma mater he went to high school there I'm a chaperone today and so we're gonna be taking about, about 30 kids into Disneyland they have a couple things that they're doing there a music workshop among other things the last time you saw me at Disneyland, I was at Club 33. I had a really fancy trip. If you want to check out that trip and check out what Club 33 is like, I'll post a link in the little i card either up there or up there. Otherwise, I'll be taking you along with me on a few things I do today at Disneyland. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you are rejoining here, thank you so much for subscribing. I love having you here. I'm going to go ahead and take the camera now. We're going to go through security, get into Disney, and hopefully I'll check in with you guys when I'm inside. All right, everyone, we have arrived. The Valhalla students are here, and we have Paul, who's their fearless leader. And one of the students made this amazing Disney scavenger hunt that I'm going to try to take part in. <laughs> Check this out, find all cool things like knocking on a castle door, riding a carousel, wearing a fun Disney hat. So we're gonna have some fun today with the Valhalla Choir. Yes, it's gonna be super fun. We are in line for our first ride, Pirates of the Caribbean, and right behind me is Club 33 where we were here last time. And we're not gonna go there today unfortunately because we're with the kids, but we will still have a lot of fun. I found out that we have 49 Valhalla kids to chaperone. They have free time for about an hour, so we're thinking we had to get on a ride, but there's 49 of them doing a music workshop here. So that'll keep our hands full for today. Luckily, since they're in high school, they're pretty independent, and we don't have to check in with them until noon, so we are going on a ride by ourselves right now. Look at that the treasure trove on the Pirates ride. There's been some controversy over this take a wedge for a bride. And, and now you have been dressed. Do I hear six? Who makes it six? Six should be. Six. About to go up Tarzan's treehouse, and there's something really cool that I want to show you about this place. It was here last time. Not sure if it's still going to be here. Uh, I haven't been to Tarzan's treehouse for a couple years, but last time there was something really cool. So I'll show you guys. It's something kind of hidden, and see if you have seen it before. Still in Tarzan's treehouse. If you take a look at everything at Disney, there's all this cool decor. There's these little teapots behind. Teapots hidden throughout Tarzan's Treehouse. This is my absolute favorite. It's a little hidden Disney secret. They put in a different Disney movie, completely different Disney character, little chip from Beauty and the Beast. I love it. We had to start putting that back in, so making sure kids aren't taking off their shoes, getting comfy. Uh, those are really our biggest thing. There are the emergency. Of course, do that, but I'll probably, hopefully, everybody's used the restroom because it's right behind you. Um, but I'll double check with everybody before we begin. In the last clip, there was a Disney cast member giving us instructions on being a chaperone. Yes, that's right, I'm a Disney chaperone. I thought this was kind of cool because it's not something that you can get every day at Disneyland. This is something that is very unique and I'm going to keep this as a souvenir because you can't really ask for one of these things unless you are an actual Disney chaperone. There's some more in the back. I'm really excited to be here with all these Valhalla kids. They are super talented and I cannot wait to see what they do inside the recording studio. Secret Mickey, that's really cool. Yeah, somebody's doing the hunt. <laughs> Right, we are leaving the cast members only section. I couldn't film or take photos of anything in there, but I'll tell you all about it once we get out to Toontown. Here we are. Rodney and I, along with six other adults, were chaperones. We got these special chaperone stickers. All of the Valhalla kids just did these special recording sessions with Disney. They got to record themselves in actual Disney soundtracks and movies. It was really amazing, but it was kind of a little private thing that we got behind the scenes access 
too. So definitely wasn't able to show that. They made sure everything was turned off. And the behind the scenes of Disney was pretty interesting. It looks really magical out here, and then in the back it's a little bit drab, but that's where all the magic takes place, and it's where everything happens to make everything look so magical out here. So very cool that we got to experience that. I, I know the kids all loved it. There's 49 of them, and they all did an amazing job. We are leaving Toontown. I'm about to go ahead somewhere to find some lunch. I've always heard about these giant pickles at Disneyland. I've never tried one. Decided to pick one up and try one for the very first time. I'm sure it tastes like a regular pickle, but it's Disneyland, so maybe it'll be a magic pickle. Let me see what it tastes like. <laughs> Rodney's laughing at me. Just a regular pickle, but I do love pickles. I'm gonna finish this whole thing. Five dollar pickle. Yeah, this is. Here, let me show you. It's a giant pickle. Five dollar pickle. But I think it's worth it for a quick, refreshing snack at Disneyland. About to go on the Pinocchio ride. Don't think I've actually ever been on this one before, but not 100% sure. I love the way that the ride is decorated. It's really cool. We are going on. It's a small world. We actually have the whole cruise boat, which is what they called it to ourselves. Because, fortunately, the kid got sick in line right in front of us, so they had to cut off the line and turn it to the other side. So we got our own private little boat. Last time I was on this ride, it was a Christmas theme. So this time it's going to be a little bit different because they're not going to have all those Christmas decorations. Check out this really cute pin they gave me. It says, what does it say? Disney snack time. Pretty cool. I'm going to enjoy my Dolip float. And we're going to go watch the Tiki show. Oh, it's called? Ghost from the guitars and beat the drum. We've been a hit and we know you adore us. So come on and join us in another chorus. It is the evening time. The kids are going to be going back on the bus back to San Diego. Rodney and I are staying an extra night here. We don't want to drive back tonight, so we always get a hotel room after going to Disneyland for the day. I just saw the Tangled show. It was a lot of fun. First time seeing that. I also saw the Tiki Room show earlier. So I've done a lot of things today. All right, this is take two of ending the vlog. They were moving the benches. They were moving my backpacks. I got a little bit distracted because I didn't have my backpack with me, and they were moving it away. So I wanted to say again, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't. Leave me a comment with one of your favorite things to do at Disneyland. Next time I come here, I want to check out some new things. I always love discovering some hidden new things to do, so make sure you leave me a comment. This was a really fun trip. Again, I was here chaperoning a bunch of high school kids for an amazing studio experience behind the scenes that they had, but fortunately, couldn't get any clips of that. All right, everyone. Thank you again so much, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.